sassies welcome back to my channel and welcome boo if you're new make sure you guys are subscribed i'm putting on notifications so you don't miss any of my uploads for today's video i'm going to be sharing with you guys my current obsessions part two really quick i'm wearing these like love shack fancy pants they're like blue with the bows on there it's like my favorite print ever i have the matching sports bra and i'll link it down below this is also one of my favorite sets i think i've worn this like 10 times already since i've had it very comfy very cute highly recommend the next piece i want to show you guys is a sports bra that i got from nordstrom rack i think i showed it in one of my recent vlogs as well this is just a pink one i literally have been living in them they have just been in my holy grail i'm obsessed with these they're super stretchy look at this removable cupping so if you just want to free the nip you do you boo i literally love these i'm wearing the gray one right now and i have it in black and white as well where the hell are my spanky pants <laughs> comment down below if you know where that's from oh i'm watching that tonight anyways my next favorite has been these little leggings they look a little stretched out a little janky but i wore the black ones yesterday and i've been wearing the gray ones a lot too i've really been loving gray i've always loved gray but I love it even more this spring for some reason. So, 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 so cute. Anyways, it's from American Eagle. And if I can find them, I'll link them down below. There is like a little pocket detail on each side. Very, very stretchy. Look at this. Like, yeah. My next two pieces are also a sports bra and pants. Um, it's Love Shock Fancy and what is this? Bandier. I have a lot of LSF, so don't get tired of me. I just genuinely love the company and their stuff. I don't know if it's showing up, but I very much prefer this side even though i don't think you can wear it inside out the little pastel blue roses i love that print is stunning i love tie-dye too but i just think the roses are a little bit prettier anyways this one is a racer back i love like the strappy design i got a small in both pieces and then i just have the matching pants my friend chloe griffin here on youtube i'll link her instagram and her youtube down below go check her out subscribe she actually dm me and was like they're having a sale on like the lsf collab and i was like really and the only two pieces that were like in stock in my size that can like go together was this one so i got these i also just love how high-waisted these are and then obviously the little prints that i prefer is all over so cute and the side is like the tie-dye that matched the sports bra the only con about these pants is that like it just gets super dingy really fast so i don't know if you guys can see the little fuzzies i was watching a favorites or a girly amazon must have haul from my friend tia mcintosh also here on youtube i'll link her stuff down below as well she mentioned like a little fabric cutter thing from amazon i think and it can like remove the fuzzies so i think i'm gonna try one of those it's just so annoying like i literally wore these maybe a total of two three times maybe and it's already like just so dingy i really don't want to use that word but i love these like they're such good quality i love that these are high-waisted they're just so supportive i love the thick waistband i really wish they had like a pocket or something but the design is super cute but the little pieces that i got from the beach riot collab perfect 10 out of 10 there's no fuzzies there's no dinge love these so that's all of like my fashion clothing pieces honestly truly if i'm not wearing leggings or like one of these sets and sports bras I'm probably wearing a dress from Dolls Kill. I have so many dresses on my like dress rack, but they have a line called Sugar Thrills, and I'm obsessed with all of their dresses. They're so cute, so dainty. I love the puff sleeves. I just feel like windy right now. Like I have a little bow in my hair. If you guys are curious, my bow was actually wrapped in a bow around my Love Shack Fancy bracelets. Bracelets? Mm. It is 8.05, and I haven't had anything to drink or to eat today please ignore me i've just been trying to like pre-film it came wrapped in a bow around my love shack fancy blanket i also have the blue one highly obsessed this should have been in my favorites as well i love 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 these i sleep with them every single night they're very stretchy super big like i think they're 50 by 70 i'm not sure the standard blanket size but these are perfect i can't wait to take these on vacation with me and just kind of snuggle i just didn't want to overwhelm you guys with all the lsf stuff but they're genuinely like my favorite company right now and i love all their pieces like to die for my next piece is going to get put to use this weekend actually because i really want to bake and if you watched my recent vlog where i did a haul i've been obsessed with aprons and this one is fairly new it's also from the sugar thrills brand or like line on dolls kill why can't i talk today it is so cute like can we just take a moment and admire this apron first of all i love the like off-white kind of like pale yellow color i just am obsessed i actually had um a cape that looked like this from an antique shop just obsessed with yellow i just love it against my skin tone how cute would this have been like as an apron or 
as a cape see wow this is more for like aesthetic photo purposes i mean it's really not going to protect me from stains or like cake batter or anything but this is so cute i had to have this okay i have two more lsf pieces so i'm just gonna get it out of the way don't hate me but the next one um is their beach towels they have so many different names so i don't know the exact name but i will link this one that i am going to show you down below first of all these are like oversized extra large like it's folded in half and it's just so oops it's so big these are my top towels that i use for bathing like you know how some towels like you dry off and it leaves like a ton of residue it's all these little fuzzies on you it gets on your hands and i wear contacts so me like drying off after a shower and like doing skincare my towels and hand towels are so important to me because i can't have too much fuzz or like something is always in my eyes it's just it's a pain i think these retail for 95 dollars each and I actually couldn't choose which one I wanted at the time. I was like, should I get the one with the bows? But they have a pink and a blue one with bows. So should I get this one? But then they have like a purple and a blue one like this. I was like, you know what? Let me just treat myself. So I actually picked up all six or five towels. I think it's five towels from this collection. And I'm obsessed with them. I still have two of them that I didn't open because I already have used three. And I'm like, okay, that's a bit extreme. So safe to say these are my favorite towels. I'm obsessed with how large they are because they are beach towels. But I do use them for my indoor use as well. Like I said, I just really love a good fabric that doesn't leave any residue behind. But I really do enjoy sleep masks. I feel like I can never sleep without one. I have like a sensitivity to light and sound so if a pin drop or someone turn on the light and just be making noise i wake up so these are a lifesaver and this one is just so cute it reminds me of marie antoinette and it just says fancy on it. it has like a little cake and it's just the design was so well thought out and it's just so cute i love that it's satin and i love that it has like a little travel pouch my next accessory is like this cute little champagne bow i have been obsessed with hair ties as of recently I don't know why like I even just will wear them like this I think they're just so cute and this one not so much because it keeps flopping but I do wear like their microfiber ones all the time and I just forget that they're on my wrist anyways these are so cute like if my hair was like in a low ponytail with my short hair I just think like the oversized exaggerated bows are stunning I don't know why it could be because I was watching pretty woman and she had like her hair tied back with something could be anyways this is just so cute there's not really much i can say about it other than like it's just oversized and very different than anything that i own i can imagine to be really pretty with the high ponytail as well so super cute my next favorite has been these earrings i haven't worn the rose gold yet because i've just been wearing the silver they pretty much match with everything and i'm also just really lazy when it comes to taking out my earrings like i just very lazy i'm calling myself out these are so cute these are by nanette lapore i get these i took the sticker off but i think like tj maxx or ross those kind of stores i think they're mostly at tj maxx i showed these in a haul like on my vlogs and these are to die for they're probably my favorite like studs i guess i can call these these not really studs kind of they're like my favorite piece to wear i've been wearing them every single day you guys have been seeing me wear these in like every single vlog so you know i'm not lying i'm obsessed and these are only like ten dollars like sure they retail for a lot more but in tj maxx they're only ten dollars so I'm obsessed anytime I see like rose gold jewelry or like juicy couture jewelry I have to get it my last favorite I'm gonna show you guys today has been like this like hair styling mat I don't know the proper name for it um, but it's by the mermaid hair company it's like a two-piece so um, this one is just pink they do have a black option if you just want your stuff to be like sleek because I know some girls are not into like the hot pink or pink in general so the outer part right here is the matte part like you lay it flat on like a table a couch wherever you're styling your hair your vanity you just lay this out and you can put all your hot tools on top of here so you don't melt your table or mess up any wood I just decided to invest in one of these from the company because I bought the hair dryer the diffuser the brush I bought like all the cute little stuff so i was like why not just get a little mat something i don't have but it's something i recommend every girl should get or every guy whatever i think you guys need this so yeah the outer part is the mat and then the inner part that just kind of velcros like that this is for like if your tools are still hot and like say you just did your hair and you got to catch a flight you don't really have time to sit there and wait for your flat irons to cool off so you just roll them up and you put them right in this little pouch where it's safe and it's also lined with the little protectant stuff on the inside as well you just zip it up and throw it in your bag it's anyways that was part two to my current obsessions 
love 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 everything that i just showed you guys to a t again everything will be linked down below let me know down below in the comments if you guys have the same or similar objects that i showed you guys today also feel free to comment down below any other video ideas you guys want to see from me i've been thinking about doing a spring wish list type of video where i basically share with you guys things that i'm currently looking for to add to my wardrobe or to add to like my little accessory little staple pieces so let a girl know because I definitely will hop on that video and I really enjoy these sit down type of like intimate style like vlogs because I'm always on the go. I never really get to sit here and talk to you guys and just relax so it's really nice and I think this is going to kind of be like my permanent sitting area because the lighting is great and I get to sit comfortably on my bed and I also love my new little print back here. As always if you guys enjoy give this video a big thumbs up make sure you guys are subscribed and don't forget to stay sassy have courage and always be kind spread nothing but love and positivity and I will see you in my next sassy vlog. Bye boos! Yeah.